All right, how's it going, everybody? Welcome to another month in uh, Pro Wrestling Heartland. Still don't have any sort of logo set up, but that's all right. Uh, we are in June 1920. Uh, what have we had? Four events? Three events? We've had three events so far. Um, we've not been great, but we've been going around here. Let's see here. Minneapolis, Sioux Falls. So probably go to like Omaha since we are a bit of a... A bit of a small traveling show. Um, don't think there's much left to do. Let me see here. I'm pretty sure our availability is Wednesday week two. I think we've been, yeah, we've been doing Saturday week two. So we just keep that going there. Make that active. Save it. There you go. We've got 12 days until the next show. We've got our championship. Uh, were we going to run a... T I don't think we were going to run a title match right now. Uh, holds belts up Foley. Oh, okay. So we had a possible match with uh, Grayson Foley. Oh, yeah, that's right. I think we were creating... We were trying to find a number one contender. So I think that's actually what that was. So we've got the big Johnny Watson, Grayson Foley match to do. So we should at least pre-book that. It'd probably be nice if I set up what I usually set up for my TEW stuff. I don't know why I haven't done that yet. <laughs> I got a whole big setup stuff for uh, my Vertigo and Idol Fight stuff, and I haven't set up any of my worksheets or anything for, for this. And that's why I just not i think it's because there's so few people and that there's people that i'll probably get rid of the minute i get better people coming in <laughs> the minute there's better people who could do this stamina is only a 52 so 13 minutes at best i would say uh, let's see here everything else is good we can just book it when we get there oh no what, what are you now? What? Why do I have to deal with shitty memes? Why do I have to deal with shitty memes? There we go. Heartland World Title. There you go. Now I get to put that in there. Uh, pre book. Let me see here. As far as other pre booking stuff goes, let me let me look at the show history. Let's see, wants to know this bill Rolo. Oh yeah, we gotta we gotta put Rolo Love out. We gotta we gotta have him doing his thing. That absolutely is gonna be a thing. Rolo Love needs needs to go out there and do his thing. Did I watch it? No, I didn't watch it. I'm doing a stream. I'm busy. Uh, let's see here. All right. Rolo should face. Oh, God. I don't know what Rolo, who Rolo should face. Should he face Regan Youngblood? I don't know if that's a good idea. Uh, I don't know. Is this guy going to be a face? Rolo could be a face. Let me see here. Francis Kurtz. Kurtz and Blackwell. Blackwell could probably face him. Or he could face uh, Ashton Gresham. Ashton Gresham should probably be the next guy. How about that? So we can do pre-booking. We can pre-book a match. We'll do Rolo against Ashton Gresham. How long? You see a 68 and a 10. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. So what? Four minutes? Four minute match. Cool. All right. Cool. Uh, Blackwell should probably do something. Steven Schaffner. Let's see. Schaffner's been doing pretty okay right now. Be Wildman Rocco. 
He beat Foley and Andrade, but he got a loss to Nate Blackwell. Let me let me see here. I'm thinking. Hmm. Kurt says the Enforcer found a new partner in Blackwell, so maybe Kurtz and Blackwell should face a couple other guys. Uh, Trent Tubbs, maybe. Here, let me let me add uh, pre-booking, so we can pre-book another tag match. And we'll do Francisco Kurtz and Nate Blackwell. And who are some guys? Astonishing Squirrel. Maybe we could put Astonishing Squirrel in there. And maybe another potential face. Who's a face? Bunnell? Mr. Fantastic. How about Squirrel in Fantastic? There you go. All right. What are we looking at with this? We're looking at the 51, 87, 76, and 55. So uh, 10 minutes. I bet you they can go 10 minutes. There you go. <laughs> Uh, let me see here. Maybe pre-book another match. I'm thinking. Let's see. We had Woman Rocco there. Sheriff Casper. How about, oh, you know what? We should do something with uh, Sheriff Casper coming out and uh, calling out I want Sheriff Casper to come out, and he's going to call out uh, Regan Youngblood. I mean, the man tried to murder a man in the ring. 66 stamina, 69 stamina. Hey, you can actually go like 13 minutes on that. Maybe actually closer to 14 or 15. That might be a show. We'll just put that there. Hey, four matches. That's pretty good. I think we might might put something else in there. Just uh, who's who. Uh, just uh, just something, something quick and easy in there. I think on the next one. But for right now, that's just where we'll be. And we're basically just going along. Oh, cannot advance. Oh, we got a decision. Oh, yeah, that's right. Joe Freer. Joe Freer has been added. Uh, I'll see what I'll do with him. See what I'm going to do. Oh, we got an email. Oh, Joe Freer got... Oh. See, now that we've, now that we've hired Joe Freer, now... SPW has to hire Joe Freer. Not Joe, you didn't want Joe Freer originally. Now you want Joe Freer now that we've got him. Gotcha. I see where we're going with this. All right. So tonight, Heartland Wrestling Live 4. We're going to go down to Omaha, Nebraska. <laughs> Popularity is not big, but it's it'll get there. How much how much money do we got? We are three hundred and twelve in debt. We've made about three fifty three. Uh, it's about how much our workers are in the show. We might we might do okay with sponsors. Uh, where are we at with sponsors? Nine forty a month. We'll probably get over a thousand this month in uh, sponsorship. Possibly, we'll see. All right. So that should help. But nonetheless, here we go. Oh, me. I want to make sure that uh, we didn't have any. Oh, we do have backstage incident. Oh, God, that's a lot of them. Uh, Bunnell and Grayson Foley. Uh, Mean-spirited rim on Foley that led to a fight. Nearly led to a fight breaking out. You have to deal with him. Bunnell is a troublemaker personality. Um, we'll give him a... Maybe a slap on the wrist. We'll give him a slap on the wrist. 
Philip Reinhardt did something. He got a lot of heat for his recent attitude. The signs it could turn a very bad situation if it's not handled soon. I'm going to give him a stern warning. It has a small positive impact upon him, and he's happy about this action. Rollo Lowe, he's gotten a lot of heat for his selfish behavior. I'm going to give him a stern warning, too. Nothing happened from that. All right. So I think, does that end up kind of helping push their... Uh, what was he? He's still a mercenary, but I think that helps push their uh, their uh, behavior so they're not so much of a problem. That'll be nice. Uh, nonetheless, we have got a show to book. Pre-booking. Uh, let's see here. Open it up. Uh, what are we going to open it up with? Uh, Sheriff Casper will open it up. Add that to the booking sheet. And let's see here. I think Casper gets the win. Maybe. Yeah. Casper will get the win. However, I'm going to make it an open match. Make it a tainted win. An intentional DQ finish. So he's maybe going to attack him and then maybe try to do something afterwards. So makes sense. We'll make it make sense. There you go. Then we've got, uh, let's do Rolo and Ashton because that's not, that's going to take what, four minutes? Yeah. Uh, Rolo getting the win. And we'll open match. We'll decisive win. There you go. What's his, what's his finish? An overhead slam. Against Ash and Gresham, who's got a Savat kick. All right. Nonetheless, he gets the win. Uh, are we going to add something in the middle with these guys? Add Just add some random guys for a match, maybe? Let me see here. If we add a match, say we add a... Let's add a regular tag. I just want to see. Exclude the already booked guys. Well, trying to see. Okay. Hmm. Isn't Blackwell already doing something in Mr. Fantastic? Oh, you know what? I haven't added in the other stuff. How about I do that first? I add the guys, other guys on the booking sheet, and then I deal with everything. So, Kurtz and Blackwell versus Squirrel and Fantastic. Uh, Nate Blackwell getting the victory. We're going to do open match, but a decisive win. Since Nate Blackwell's getting the win. Man deserves it. All right. And then main event, Johnny Watson versus Grayson Foley. And uh, Watson getting the victory here. We're going to make that an open match as well, though, but a decisive win nonetheless. You going to bed? Well, all right. Have a good night. And I think, I think that's it. We're going to make it pretty simple. It's 49 minutes, so we do have a little bit of time to add. We want to throw in one more match. Just like a quick six-man tag. See you tomorrow? Maybe. I'll, I'll see. I'll see what, I, what I'm going to do. Let's see. Let's do Trent Tubbs, Stephen Schaffner, Nicolaj Brunel, Nino Apodaca, Fredo Nunez, and Carl Andrade. <clears throat> Make this literally a four minute match. Who should win? Maybe Nino should get the win. 
What does mass history look like? Mm, could give it to Schaffner. Keep him going. He's been doing okay. Fredo Nunez also has been doing pretty okay. Hmm. Ah, damn it. Do I want to give it to Schaffner or, nu or uh, Apodaca? Let's give it to Nino Apodaca. How about that? Open match. I'll make it a tainted win if he's gonna if he's gonna win. There you go. Ends up cheating a little bit to get the win on uh, to get the win on Schaffner. There you go. That'll work. Oh, invalid data. Oh, is that really? The minimum has to be five minutes. That's all right that there all right I could do that all right so Sheriff Casper Sheriff Casper is gonna come out he wants Regan Youngblood let's see Casper calls out Youngblood plans to beat him in match then Arrest him for attempted murder. There you go. Uh, his microphone is, is young blood kind of a mic guy. Yeah, he could do it. So both of them on the microphone. Agreeing to this match. <laughs> it's a, uh, uh, what is it? Uh, uh, what is it? Oh, <laughs> you know what I'm going to call this? I'm going to, I'm going to call this an arrest warrant match. This is going to be, this is going to be a first in pro wrestling history. Sheriff Casper versus Regan Youngblood. If Youngblood is pinned or submitted, ends up losing, <laughs> he is under arrest and an arrest warrant match. Fantastic. And after, of course, uh, losing by disqualification for beating him up, uh, Regan Youngblood... Uh, is going to uh, Charisma. Yeah, we'll do that. Let's see. Youngblood after his DQ decides to run out before Sheriff can recover. There you go. Just like two minutes on that. I shouldn't have put two R's. Whatever. There we go. Um, not much going on with this one, I guess. Apodaca getting the win, but I'm going to go with... Uh, Trent Tubbs and Nino Apodaca. We're still going to leave people uh, going home a little bit happy. How about that? Can Nino sell? Nino could probably sell, right? His selling is okay. How about that? And his charisma. So minor success, minor defeat. There you go. Tubbs grabs Moonshine. Drinks it, then knocks out Nino with empty jar. There you go. 
So even even in a even in a heel winning situation, Tubbs still Tubbs can still get a little bit of heat back after nearly getting murdered last month. Rolo and Ashton Gresham. I don't think there's much going on between that one, so I might just leave it alone because we only got eight minutes anyway. Kurtz and Blackwell, another thing that not really it's, it's not really going to be a huge deal, I think, right now. So I think I'm going to do Johnny Watson is going to have a let's do four minutes. Uh, microphone, minor success. Watson talks about Foley and the disrespect to the champion. Plans to win tonight. Just very, very basic. Disrespected the champion. Now this is what's going to happen. And then Johnny Watson, Joe Freer. Let's see what he can do. There we go. It's, it's perfect, isn't it? <laughs> and then, uh, and then also we have Philip Reinhardt. <laughs> uh, let's see here. What's his selling? His selling is terrible. So maybe we should do something else. Ask Rutt. Minor defeat, minor success. Watson celebrates. Career debuts and lays out the champion poses with title. Four minutes on the last bit. There you go. 75 full minutes done and done. All right. Looks like we, we covered just enough uh, just enough time on the events as well because it's not telling us we did too much here. I'll knock a minute off of this and a minute off of this just to be safe. And now I think we're good. All right. Let's do this. All right, starting off with Pro Wrestling Heartland, Heartland Wrestling Live 4. We're going a little bit further south down to Omaha, Nebraska. 84 people came to watch this. We're going to keep going from last month. The Sheriff Casper is uh, unhappy about the attempted murder from Regan Youngblood last month as uh, he, he calls out Youngblood and says that he has a special type of match set up uh that is called an arrest warrant match so he has an arrest warrant on the line and uh if he can beat regan youngblood then regan youngblood will officially be under arrest but if youngblood can find a way to beat casper uh he will be free to go so uh youngblood comes out to uh to um accept it and that is what we will get now as we had Sheriff Casper versus Regan Youngblood does a little bit, you know, does okay, 1352, but Youngblood potentially got disqualified, hit Sheriff Casper with a weapon, and uh, lays him out, and Sheriff Casper starts bleeding a little bit, and, uh, well, Casper ends up getting the win by DQ, so it's it's un, unsure exactly uh, if uh, Youngblood uh, still is officially under arrest after that. I mean, Casper did win. But we don't really get to find out as uh, Youngblood uh, decides to run out, takes a couple of uh, Sheriff Casper's things before he can recover, and uh, hauls out of there, including taking the arrest warrant that uh, Sheriff Casper had. So we'll see perhaps what will come of that. Six-man tag, Trent Tubbs, Stephen Schaffner, Mikolaj Bunnell versus Nino Apodaca, Frido Nunez, and Carl Andrade. A terrible match, only got a four. Jesus Christ. Of course, it is a four-minute match thanks to the likes of Benel. Even Trent Tubbs with his, like, two stamina or whatever it is. Good Lord, I cannot wait to get some actual money to bring some actual people in. 
I should maybe just I should maybe just find some just not use some of these tunes. <laughs> but nonetheless, 436, Nina Apodaca submitted Stephen Schaffner. He blatantly cheated, though. Looked like Schaffner is gonna get the win, but Apodaca low blows him. Which knocks him to the ground, and uh, Apodaca then la- locks in the crossface chicken wing uh, when Schaffner tries to get back up to recover and uh, submit Schaffner as uh, Apodaca getting the win for himself, Nunez, and Andrade. But afterwards, uh, Trent Tubbs, not happy about how that has how that has gone down, grabs a jar of moonshine. Starts drinking it down and then knocks out Nino Apodaca with the uh, empty jar. And we get some some uh, some worked glass going all over the place as uh, Tubbs celebrates uh, at least getting a slight measure of revenge over Apodaca with his cheating. We get Rolla Love, who debuted last month, uh, taking on the debuting Ashton Gresham. Only went about 4.16, but Rolo gets the win with his overhead slam and uh, gets the win over Gresham here. And not a great rating, but nonetheless, uh, that, that'll, be, that'll be another win for Rolo Love. We move to a tag team contest. Francisco Kurtz and Nate Blackwell started teaming up last month as Kurtz uh, started employing Blackwell. This time they're taking on the Astonishing Squirrel and Mr. Fantastic. Not too bad. Fantastic's got a 19. Nate Blackwell's got a 19. Subpar wrestling in little heat, but nonetheless, Kurtz and Blackwell end up getting the the win after Nate Blackwell thrust kicks Mr. Fantastic in the face and gets the pin. And this little uh, team up of Kurtz and Blackwell seems to be doing quite well. And we are up to the main event, Johnny Watson the heartland world champion he talks about grayson foley sucker punching him last month and the disrespect that he had shown to the heartland world champion and uh, plans to win tonight to get a measure of revenge and put a little bit of respect into grayson foley and so we get johnny watson and grayson foley for the world title in this first official defense watson in 13 minutes, gets the win by pinfall over Grayson Foley. Decent enough little match there. Uh, it was one of the better matches. But nonetheless, Johnny Watson getting the win and uh, his first official defense of the Heartland World title. And it is at that point. Oh, I forgot to put I forgot to put Johnny Watson out there. Whoops. Good for me. Uh, as Johnny Watson celebrates, though. Uh, We get Joe Freer debuting. He stares down the champion for a minute and then lays him out. And uh, as as Watson is recovering, Joe Freer grabs his belt, lifts it up, and poses with the title. And that is how we end the show. 24 is actually not bad. I'm going to single out my... (laughs) I can't even single out myself. Um... Let me see here. Uh, Rolo did okay. Uh, Tubbs, Trent Tubbs did all right. And uh, Nate Blackwell carried as best he could as well. So we're going to give them some compliments for all that. Seem please, seem please, and seem please. There you go. Easy peasy. I'm even further into debt now. I don't think I'm going to turn a... Yeah, I'm definitely not going to turn a profit this month. But I think maybe next month we might actually turn a profit. Let me look at finance. How much did I spend? 500 So that's more than I've ever spent yet. But it's not a, a, an obscene amount yet. So we might be able to turn a profit next month, I think think I probably could have gotten pretty close to being able to do if I didn't bring in some of the outside talent, but I didn't really have much of a choice, really. I've had not the greatest, uh, ooh, I thought I saw some new people. Let's see here. Now that's April. Uh, Levi Andrews announced his retirement. Joe Freer. 
downward spiral. So we haven't had any big news happening right now. I'm still watching just to see anything that might happen. I don't think any. I don't think anything big's happening. See, they gotta they gotta fill out with with something. They gotta always fill it out. Oh, I saw I saw what looked like a new face. Maybe doesn't look like it. Maybe I just gotta look and see. Oh, there it was. Grayson Seals. That's a look, man. Where is he at? Southeast. I feel like I might have passed over him for a reason. His stamina is not great. Or basics are selling or safety and consistency. He's a good manager, though. He's a good actor. He's wild. Ooh. All these shortlist him. He's a potential like manager. He can come out and manage somebody, maybe. I could see it happening. Sunday, Monday. All right, we are officially in July. So wrestler of the year so far, Frito Nunez, who uh, I believe started with us, but uh, SPW has been using him thus far. Match of the year thus far was Sir Anthony Henry and Daniel Loisel at SPW Way of the Warrior show of the year so far as way of the warrior young wrestler of the year grayson foley one of our guys that uh oh no he wasn't one of our guys he was a guy that was was he generated i think he was generated looks like it maybe <laughs> i can't even remember now uh let's see politics and reader support and there you go all right Easy, easy. No new people have entered wrestling yet, so nothing to really look forward to except some of the people that I've already shortlisted as a possibility. Uh, I lost $92, so if I keep up where I'm at right now, I should start making money uh, next month. Also, my merchandise is next to nothing, but that's all right. But we made over $1,000, so that's pretty good. Should make maybe about 1100 or so, maybe even more. Who knows? Uh, come time for uh, next month. So, hey, we might actually start turning a profit, start making some money. And then we can start hiring these people who are actually good and start kicking, the cur kicking to the curb these guys who aren't useful for me at all. The guys who are just doing nothing but putting on terrible segment after terrible segment, and then I can have some actual people. Uh, nonetheless, there you go. Very quick, very easy. I'm only up to a three. That's all right. Uh, size, size, size. Let's look at the title. Current prestige. Does it show me my prestige? Prestige has been pretty much the same the entire time. Uh, I'm trying to figure out figure out uh, what else there is to remember. Oh my goodness. Size. That's what I was thinking of. So we're getting the spill over, over a little bit, so that's good. But nonetheless, God, that was just over half an hour. Oh, my God. I didn't think it was going to take me that little amount of time. But you know what? I managed to get this done out the way, and uh, maybe I could do a whole other month um, uh, here really soon. And then I, I, I don't have to worry too hard about this, and I can keep this going. Uh, but nonetheless, thank you guys for coming out. I greatly appreciate it. It's been it's late. I'm almost. I'm like three hours in, and it's it's late. So I'm sure everyone would like to get some sleep. So thank you guys. I appreciate you guys being here. If you're watching this on YouTube, thank you very much for continuing to watch. I greatly appreciate it, and I uh, hope to see you guys next time. <laughs>